In this video, we'll calculate the formal charge for each element in HSO4 minus. This is the hydrogen sulfate ion. So we'll start out looking at a Lewis structure for HSO4 minus. If you need help, there's a link in the description how to draw this Lewis structure. We'll use formal charges to determine whether this is the most likely or favorable Lewis structure for HSO4 minus. So let's do the sulfur in the center first. Here's sulfur. That's in group 16, sometimes called 6A. So it has six valence electrons. Unbonded, all of the electrons around the sulfur, they're involved in chemical bonds. So we don't have any unbonded electrons. And we have more than eight valence electrons around the sulfur here, but that's okay. It can have an expanded octet. When we look at bonded electrons, we're gonna take one half of them. So we have a double bond here. That's two plus two, that's four. We have another four. And then we have the single bond, that's two and two more. So eight, 10, 12 total electrons around the sulfur there in chemical bond. We'll divide that by two. So we have six minus six, zero. So the formal charge on the sulfur here in the center, that's just gonna be zero. Let's do this oxygen right here. It's the same as this one, they're both double bonds. So let's do the double bonded oxygen. Oxygen is in group 16 as well, so it'll have six valence electrons. Unbonded, two, four, minus one half of the bonded. These are the bonded ones, the double bond. So that has four in it, and we'll divide that by two. Six minus four is two, minus two, that's zero for each one of these oxygens here. So let's put a zero up here. How about we do the single bonded oxygen next? So with single bond, we have six, it's oxygen, it will always be six. Then we have unbonded, two, four, six, minus the bonded, which is right here, just this single bond, so two over two. That gives us six minus six is zero minus one, a minus one formal charge on this oxygen right here. Let's do the oxygen bonded to the sulfur and the hydrogen. So we have six because it's oxygen. We have unbonded electrons, two, four, minus one half of the bonded. We have the bond here, so that's gonna be two. And then we have the bond here, another two. So four over two. So six minus four is two minus two, that gives us zero. So this oxygen right here has a formal charge of zero and hydrogen with a single bond, that'll have a formal charge of zero as well. So what we find is that everything is zero except for this oxygen here with a single bond. This is our double bond, this is our single bond, and this is bonded to the OH there. So everything's zero except this one here, the single bond, but that makes sense because we have this one minus here, so it needs to match the charge. The formal charge needs to match the charge on the ion. Because everything's as close to zero as possible, the formal charges tell us that this is a really good Lewis structure for HSO4 minus, very favorable, more likely Lewis structure. This is Dr. B calculating the formal charge for each element in HSO4 minus hydrogen sulfate ion. The hydrogen sulfate ion. Thanks for watching.